Hello YouTube and Facebook, thank you all for joining me on today's edition of 5 Minutes with Chris and today is all about graduations. Now, I just recently attended a graduation for uh, my sister as a matter of fact. She just graduated high school and she's deser she deserves a round of applause. So everybody please join in with me right now, give her a little round of applause and that's it. Alright, enough's enough. Now. You know, I like to give credit where it's due, after all. I mean, that's how I am. But, you know, there comes a certain point in time where you just get sick and tired of hearing about things over and over again. I mean, oh, she graduated. Oh, she went here. She's graduating. She did this. She did that. I don't give a fuck anymore. I hear about it on a goddamn daily basis. I don't need to hear about it every fucking day, even at a graduation, too. But you know what? I digress. Now... As for the ceremony that I attended, which really I didn't have a choice, I had to go because after all it was either one of two options, either I go and I support my sister, or I pack my bags and get the fuck out of the house, because really that's the only two options I had, and I wasn't about to, you know, go without a home, you know, I, I don't have a job, so it, that would have been pretty difficult to live under a bridge with the other hobos, you know, to have to fight for a, a certain spot, um... And I didn't really want to go through that, so I figured, you know what, what the hell, I may as well go through with the graduation. But, I gotta tell you people something. Much like this story that I'm telling you right now, it was the most boring goddamn time of my life. I mean, really. Two and a half hours of nothing but the principal praising everybody and, and you know, telling her life story as well as... Um, you also had, like, all of these board of education, uh, superintendent... Uh, like all of these important people that you see, the only the only time of year that you actually see these people is when you graduate. I mean, you don't see these people the rest of the goddamn year, except for you know when people start to graduate and they can't wait to push you out of the school. I mean, you know, I can only take so much before I just want to snap. Like really, that happened rather quickly at the graduation because when I say, and I I mean no exaggeration by this, but you know. Literally 15 to 20 minutes with every guest speaker. I mean, you had the principal talk about her life story for 15 to 20 minutes. You had the uh, Board of Education person talk about his life story and, you know, his, his father and all this other stuff. And, you know, he was this and he was that and he started a plumbing company or whatever. And then he became a Board of Education guy. And, you know, I'm like, you know what, jerk off. I'll read the book when it comes out. I don't want to hear it. I mean, really, I don't. I, I was a sh I was on a short fuse like I usually am. I mean, it was hot out there. Uh, you know, I much rather would have been in my pool swimming, cooling off, you know, instead of having to worry about this crap, you know? That's really what it is. It's crap. It's for the people that actually give a damn about their education. That's what this whole ceremony is for. Now, if you're somebody like me who's pretty much making YouTube videos right now, I mean, we fast forward to, uh, you know, four years ago. Or three years ago, I graduated in 2015, you know, I never thought I'd be doing this. I mean, I, you know, I figured I would have, you know, a steady job and all of this kind of stuff. And, you know, I figured I wouldn't even be on the internet. I figured, you know, I'd have too, too much time to fill that I wouldn't even be able to be on the internet. So, you know, it's amazing what kind of games life plays with you. But, I mean, you know... I personally am a Monopoly man myself, but I feel like I'm playing Aggravation at this point. Um, but anyway, I mean, graduations, you know, they're just one big shit fest in my opinion. I feel like, you know, it's just overrated. Uh, you know, you sit through all these lectures and, and every uh, all the uh, important people stand up and talk. The valedictorians, they, well, he went up and he said his whole life story. He thanked everybody in the fucking book and... I mean, you know, again, I'll read the book when it comes out. Leave me alone. I don't want to hear you. I want to go home. I want to rest. I want to, you know, adjust my ass cheeks because at, at one point sitting on those bleachers, they were numb. I mean, I literally thought my ass cheeks were having a stroke. Like, that's how bad it was. I mean, I couldn't feel my ass cheeks at all. You know how you usually get that feeling where, you know, you, you can't help but, like, I don't know. I mean, it feels like there's, like, weights in your ass. I mean, that's really what it felt like. I mean, it, it was a horrible feeling. I wouldn't wish that on anybody, not even Hitler. But, anyway, you know, I know I'm trying to buy some time here, but you know what? Graduations, again, 
they have to go. I mean, they're for the people, they're not for the people like me that like to jerk off and, and goof around and all of that stuff. If you want to do it, you should be able to do it. I mean, in my case, I wanted to have the diploma mailed to me, but, you know, my family forbade it. So, I really didn't have a choice. I had to go through with it. But if you're one of those people that, you know, don't give a fuck, I would say don't go through with it, you know? Do what you want to do. Don't worry about what your family wants to do. And, you know, it's your day, honestly. I mean, you can't be forced by anybody into doing, by, you know, anybody into doing something that you don't want to do. So, with all this being said, I thank you all for watching this. Fuck graduations. Uh, Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, uh, Twitter, everything that I have, all social media, all go check it out, everybody. I love you all. Uh, thank you all, and goodbye, everyone.